Got a lot of questions over the last few weeks, which has been the same question that I've gotten over the last few years. And that's why don't I ride street and park anymore? I do, I'm riding park right now, but I'm hooked on flat. And there's two reasons why I like riding flat. The endless possibilities without the help of an obstacle attracts me and it's my addiction. I love being able to have this endless trick list that I probably don't have enough time on this earth to complete. And the only challenge to tap into is myself without the help of any ramp, rail. I want to inspire people who don't have a nice skate park, don't have a nice street spot, don't even have a nice scooter to go out and enjoy themselves, be fun and be creative. That's what Flatland is. It's the most creative discipline out of everything else in scootering. And that's a fact because I've done it all. Which brings us to the point of this video, as you've seen in the thumbnail, the $100 complete scooter. Envy just released the 1S3 and specific colorways to get to the price point of 100 bucks. And a lot of people out there might not be in a position to grab a custom scooter like this or even a higher end complete. And the Envy 1S3, which, which we'll be building in this video after this session, gives anybody the opportunity to get on a scooter, go out and be creative. I feel like that completes the flagship of my purpose on why I like riding flat and filming flat because it kind of goes hand in hand on what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to inspire a lot of people who don't have opportunity, who have a lot of limitations to still go out and ride, have fun. And this scooter that's a hundred bucks, which still great quality, allows you to do that. Before we build this up, we're back at the skate park, checking in with the lower back, let's see where we're at. have been game changing just because I've been feeling super good. I feel like I've unlocked a new level in my whole injury thing. The lower back is nuts, man. It's a science project. It's definitely the hardest thing to figure out. And I feel like every two weeks to a month, I figure something new out and there's just like a, I progress, I get good and then it kind of flattens out and I'm trying to figure something out and I figure something new out and then boom, another rocket. And I feel like I just got another rocket last week and I feel perfect which is why I don't want to go crazy because I don't want to take it for granted. So, But I did a heavy workout this morning, so I kind of want to just chill out, even though that's, those, aren't, those tricks aren't hard, we know that. I want to be making videos on this channel until I'm like at least like 122. So we got to take care of our body. So the NV1 S3 has been out for a little bit now. They were able to release different colors to get to this price point. Have the all black with blue accents. This is sick. Look at this. This is the NV1 S3. Black and blue complete. And out of the box, all you gotta do is put the bars on, tighten the clamp. And that's it. $100 complete gets you to full solid complete with TPR grips, steel bars, IHC compression, double clamp. Colt forks, 110 millimeter wheels, super nice grip tape, just an overall solid scooter that you can ride that we're gonna ride in today's video. The reason why I got into riding in the first place is because I love the lack of rules. You can do whatever you want, wherever you want, and I wanna make sure that rule that's not really a rule continues to exist. You guys know that I customize my scooter, I cut the deck, I have really long pegs, but Sometimes I feel not everybody has the opportunity to do that. And I don't want to turn people off from riding just because like, oh yeah, if I want to get into Flatland, I got to have this $600 titanium custom complete to be like John. Not true. You have something like this, you're going to be able to get a session just like what we're about to do right now. I'll give you one more look at this scoot. This thing is looking super nice. Love the graphics. I actually like the solid black colorways. And there's a bunch of other colorways. There's red, there's teal, there's green. And I have two scooters, one blue, one red. So we'll be making two videos in two different spots. One flat, one street. And then we'll be giving one of these completes away. I'm going to do something very special. So make sure you're subscribed to the channel. Because if you know someone who's on the younger side, who's on the smaller side, that might help you win this complete for that person. So we got five tricks that we're going to do on the NV1S3 today. Just to prove that you can ride flat. You can ride anything, but if you can ride flat, then you could definitely ride park and street. So five tricks on flat today on the NV1 S3. Mega spin gotta be first. You already probably guessed what we're gonna do.
I definitely want to do a compass. I want to do a long combo. I want to see how good this scooter can balance. And then we'll think of the fifth one. Yo, these wheels are sick. <laughs> There's so much grip and they're really smooth. I'm showing you the scooter, but this is also my first time riding it. So this is a live reaction review. You're getting exactly what I'm thinking and saying as I ride the scooter for the first time. I know I said five tricks, but I'm gonna do six because I wanna see if I can nose manual and brake wrist manual from line to line on this just to see how the scooter balances. This thing is solid. It's really exciting to have the scooter exist for all of you. Now for the final trick, I wanna do a combo. I wanna do something to prove that we can really push on the scooter. It's not just a scooter for basic tricks. We just did tricks that I'm pretty sure took me four, three to four years to learn those tricks. Obviously I can do them really easy now, but around the three to four year mark, I was able to do some of these tricks. Not all of them. That middle part I did not plan. I was just figuring out what should I do, kind of stuck in this scooty fakie position. But look, this scooter is designed for anything. The bars are on the smaller side, the wheels are on the smaller side, and the deck is on the smaller side. So I would, I would believe someone on the smaller side would be the one that's ready to scoop this. That's what I wanna do. I want people to get into riding. I don't wanna make it an untouchable. So if you see that I have this custom complete with this modded deck and all this stuff, don't get intimidated. I feel like that's the problem right now. Uh, when something gets a little too niche, it gets intimidating. And then people will see it as entertainment and not something they wanna kinda tap into. You can tap into riding with any scooter ideally. If you wanna get, if you want an inexpensive pro scooter, this is the best $100 pro scooter. If you guys wanna check out the MV1S3 and all the other colorways, check that first link in the description. This was a good session. Back feels really good, even with the low bars. Uh, looking forward to having a good summer with everyone. Looking forward to 1 million subscribers. I have something very, very special planned for that. I just got chills saying because I know what's going on. So I'll give you guys more info probably when we're at 980. So by the time this video is up, I think we're at 970. So we have 10 more to go before you know the news that we can all climb that last 20 together. Very excited, body's feeling good feeling healthy. I am beyond excited that this scooter now exists because I know people out there that like what I do but might have gotten turned off or intimidated by level of riding that I'm at, the level my scooter is at. So now for a hundred bucks you can get on one. There's no rules. Remember there's no rules. It's the reason why we started in the first place. So anyone out there riding flat, if you want to contribute to the sport and to the discipline of flatland, I'm here to make it acceptable and easy for everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Feels good to be making these long videos again. Forward to the next video, we'll be doing a giveaway and to 1 million subscribers. It's happening this year.